Hi, I'm Sohail. Today I'm going to talk about photolysis of water. The main Amen. points of the lesson are splitting of water molecule, oxygen evolving complex, or water splitting complex, and manganese ions. Photolysis is the splitting of water molecules in the presence of light into protons, electrons, and oxygen. It takes place during non-cyclic photophosphorylation. Protons are used to reduce NADP, electrons are donated to photosystem 2, and oxygen is released as a waste product. As we know that photosystem 1 and photosystem 2, which are pigment molecules along with electron transport carriers, they are embedded in thylakoid membrane. So this is photosystem 2 that becomes activated when a pigment molecule in the antenna complex that absorbs a photon of light. When pigment molecules they absorb photon, then the energy is transferred to reaction center. And in reaction center, chlorophyll A molecule is present here in photosystem 2 that is called P680, chlorophyll A molecule. And from this P680 chlorophyll A molecule, electrons are excited and they move to higher energy level. This energized electron is accepted by primary electron acceptor, which is a highly modified chlorophyll molecule that is known as pheophyton. And then it passes through electron transport chain and moves towards the photosystem 1, that is P700 chlorophyll molecule. Photolysis is a process by which water is split into oxygen and oxygen is released into the atmosphere. The hydrogen then becomes bonded to the coenzyme NADP to form NADPH and is transferred to Kelvin cycle along with ATP to fix atmospheric carbon dioxide. Photolysis of water which not only yields electrons but it is the source of almost all the oxygen in earth's atmosphere. In photosystem 2 that electron comes ultimately from water molecule which are split by a group of enzymes and that group of enzyme is called water splitting complex. It is also known as oxygen evolving complex and this is oxygen evolving complex which is bonded or attached to photosystem 2 towards the site of uh, thylakoid lumen mean towards thylakoid interior space. So the enzymes they are attached to the core complex of photosystem 2 on the site of thylakoid membrane that, that is, is facing the thylakoid lumen or thylakoid interior. Now these enzymes bind an array of four positively charged manganese ions that help to strip or take off negatively charged electrons from water molecules. During photolysis of water, water is decomposed into oxygen atoms, hydrogen ions and electrons. The electrons are held until they are passed to chlorophyll A molecule of photosystem 2 and the hydrogen ions are released to thylakoid lumen or thylakoid interior and oxygen atoms of two water molecules are combined to form oxygen molecule. The loss of electrons in photosystem 1 are replaced by the electrons of photosystem 2. And in photosystem 2, the loss of electrons are replaced by the photolysis of water. To sum up, photolysis is the splitting of water molecules in the presence of light into protons, electrons and oxygen. It takes place during non-cyclic photophosphorylation. And the protons are used to reduce NADP and electrons are donated to photosystem 2 and oxygen is released as a waste product. Oxygen evolving complex is a group of enzymes which are attached to photosystem 2 towards the site facing the thylakoid lumen. These enzymes bind an array of four positively charged manganese ions that help to take off electrons from water and donate it to photosystem 2. Let's watch this slideshow.